All right, you guys, today we're gonna check out how to make these animated stripes on Typo here in After Effects. This has been inspired from Hawke79. He does some amazing tutorials here on YouTube. You can go and check out his page. And he also got a couple of badass online courses related to kinetic typography and After Effects for beginners on Domestica, where you can get it almost for free. I'm gonna drop the links in the description. I'm gonna go and create a new composition, and rename it as text. I'm gonna go with uh, 1080p. 12 seconds, black background, click OK. Let's go and select the type tool, type in whatever you want. For the font, I'm gonna go with Akira Expanded Super Bold. Let's go and align it to the center, press the letter S, scale it up. And from here, let's go to the effects and presets and type in Venetian blinds and drag and drop it on the text. Let's go to settings, I'm gonna uncheck the transition completion, decrease the size so you can see it is going to increase or decrease the distance in between the lines and you also can increase the width of the lines like this and I'm also gonna decrease the distance in between them, something like that. And here you also got the direction, you can switch up the direction however you like. I'm gonna go with the 45 degree angle, I'm gonna decrease the width. Let's go to the effects and presets, type in choker, Let's drag and drop the simple choker under the Venetian blinds. I'm gonna go and increase the choke mat quite a bit until the edges of the straight lines are gonna become rounded. And I'm gonna go back to the Venetian blinds and decrease and adjust the settings. I'm gonna go with seven, for example. And increase the choker maybe. A little bit better maybe. Drag it under the choker, add two, splur. Drag it under the fast box, change the RGB to alpha, and let's bring these in. I'm also gonna go and decrease the distance in between the letter quite a bit. So this way I'm gonna melt them together. I'm gonna double click on the text, press and hold Alt, drag the right arrow, and this way we can add distance, adjust the kerning. And now we're gonna animate the line rotation in 360 degree angles. So make sure to bring this to the beginning. Let's go up to the direction. I'm gonna go with 45 plus. Activate the stopwatch, bring it all the way to the end somewhere here. And I'm gonna go here to the zero and type in one. And this is going to rotate it 360 degree angles. And I'm gonna need to push the keyframes all the way out. So press the letter U. So this way is going to highlight the keyframes and I'm gonna bring the keyframe all the way out. Bring it back, hit play and it rotates. And I also can animate the width and the transition. I'm gonna go to the first second somewhere here where it's going to be horizontal. Let's activate the stopwatch at the width and the transition. I'm going to bring it somewhere here. Press the letter U so it's going to highlight the keyframes. And I'm going to go to the width and increase it quite a bit. As you can see, the distance in between the lines is going to increase, but I'm going to adjust the transition and decrease the distance like that. And I'm gonna go here to the fourth second, maybe select this keyframe, press Control C, Control V, do it with the bottom one, Control C, Control V. I'm gonna select all these, right click on the keyframe, keyframe assist, select Easy Ease, and we got it like this. And this is how you can add these rounded stripes on the text here in After Effects. Thanks for watching.